Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Talk it. Walk it like I talk it. Woo. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Walk it. Walk it like I talk it. Talk it. Walk it like I. What's up, everybody? It's Excalibur. Hope you all having a great day. Today's video is the top 10 underrated skins in Fortnite Battle Royale. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Any support is greatly appreciated. If you want to know when my videos go live, follow me on Twitter. The order of these outfits are in no particular order. Feel free to comment what outfits you think are underrated. Let's jump in with number 10. Number 10, Moniker. For 1,200 V-Bucks, this rare outfit the moniker outfit features a hip hop style costume where the, the male avatar wears a dark gray hoodie. The hoodie also features some purplish pattern and is paired with brown khaki pants. Although it is a male version of the fortune outfits, the two outfits features very different design. The avatar also features a purplish monkey face pattern on the backside de depicting a monkey business, part of the sharp st style set. My reason to why this is, uh, this is underrated is it's different from the female version of the sharp style set not many people got it because of the female version the reason why it's so underrated is that it seems to be a little too plain in looks compared to the complex outfits that are coming into the game number nine steel sight 1500 v bucks the steel sight cost features a, a steel plate mail and steel armor with a right eye visual gear the entire costume looks like a steampunkish futuristic soldier when with its brown and steel gray outfit. The costume comes with an epic steel cast back wing that goes perfectly with it. It's not part of any set. My reason? Released near the end of season 3, so people were more focused on what was to come in season 4 because they were trying to save the V-Bucks. Number 8. The Sleuth and Noir. Both are 1500 V-Bucks. The Sleuth. The Sleuth Male outfit features a classic detective outfit with a thick brown jacket, a black fedora hat, and a pair of black gloves. The outfit also features a wanted person flyer sticking out of the pocket. The outfit comes with an included backlink called Evidence Bag that looks similar to the backlink called Confidential Ca Noir. The Noir male outfit features a classic detective outfit with a thick back black jacket with big buttons, a black fedora hat, and a pair of black gloves. The outfit also features a wanted person flyer sticking out of the pocket, a big pair of sunglasses, and a cool mustache. The outfit comes with an included backlink called the Clue Finder that completes the look. The skin was inspired by many noir films as well. These outfits are part of the Hardbolt set, aka the Film Noir set. The reason? These outfits aren't seen often even though they were in the Season 5 teaser trailer. As they were released, they were overcome by the outfits that were part of the Season 5 Battle Pass. Number 7, Midnight Ops, for 1200 V-Bucks. The Midnight Ops outfit features a jet black suit with a red scarf and red decals all over. The avatar also features a stylish mohawk-like hairstyle and some macho beard and mustache to complete the look. It's part of the Stealth Syndicate set. My reason? Not seen very often, those who have this outfit don't tend to, see to use it. Number 6, Cypher, for 1200 V-Bucks. The Cypher is an advanced looking female outfit that features a red and gray skin suit with advanced optical sensor sensors and gizmos. It's part of the overclock set. The reason? This outfit isn't seen very often. The fact that this outfit is advanced looking and has a circuit board based techno spy themed feel is why it shouldn't be underrated. Yet it is. Number 5. Nightlight for 800 V-Bucks. The Nightlight costume covers the character into a dark outfit and black skin paint filled with neon light decals, details, and patterns. The entire costume is filled with neon lights and multiple colors displayed in a cool pattern. The costume also features a glowing pink, pink pair of eyeglasses, part of the neon glow set. The reason? This outfit doesn't seem to be used as much as it should. The fact that the skin is easily, easily visible in the dark during a match could possibly why, be why it's underrated, yet that that's the feature that makes it different from the other skins. Number 4, Hyperion, for 1,200 V-Bucks. The Hyperion outfit is quite similar to the female Dazzle outfit. The Hyperion features an orange and gray and blue headband. The costume also comes with dark blue pants and a pair of dark boots and orange gloves. 
It's not part of any set. This outfit is ed evidently not used often, even though it has been in the game for quite some time. It seems to be like a basketball player style, and also, there is another basketball outfit in the game. Number 3. Recon Specialist for 1,200 V-Bucks. Not part of any set. This, this outfit has been in Fortnite since Season 2, although it returns to the item shop quite often. The outfit's plain and limited colors may cause people not to purchase it. Ironically, that's what makes it such an underrated outfit. Number 2. Red Nose Raider. 1,200 V-Bucks. The Red Nose Raider is a female-only outfit that features a white knitted long sleeve shirt with red pants. The most glaring feature of this outfit is its reindeer horns and ears, and the painted red nose that resembles the mythical, mythical Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer. Not part of any set. As this is a quite rare fit, that doesn't mean it's not underrated. The Red Nose Raider doesn't seem to be owned by many, mainly because it was a Christmas exclusive, but it still tends to be underrated by those who own it but don't use it. Number 1. Garrison. For 800 V-Bucks, the Garrison features a lightly armored soldier wearing green pants and a green beret. The avatar also features a black eye patch. Not part of any set. Like many uncommon outfits, the Garrison outfit never made its way into many players' lockers. Its clean design and complementary colors make it so underrated. That will just about do it for today's video, guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this top 10 video. I'm going to be doing a lot more of these top 10 videos. I have a lot more ideas. So if you guys want to send in some information about what you guys think about it. And I got some more clips here for the rest of the video. Hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. I'm on my own. Broken along. I feel the rain crashing down. All around this empty town. We're searching for the lost and found. But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air, like a blazing flare Don't stare cause the flames will burn us I thought you were the one for me That's why I gave you everything Held you close by the stormy seas Oh, you meant the world to me I used to kiss your head when you cried